is wrong with a manifesto? Even if nobody reads the manifesto, it crystallizes our purpose in our own minds. Oh, but to say we have such lofty ambitions. It is wacky, but you can't just be wacky. You can't just go out on stage and be wacky and hope to succeed in theater of the absurd. You have to present it as though it is meaning something. The manifesto is perfectly beautiful. It made me cry. Oh. You can't present it as though it's a dream. You have to present it as though it is real life. Then the audience makes a connection. Bizarre, you're insane. No, no. no that's a very good point. But no. if, if you would let me explain, stop. Women have not ever Idiopathic means of unknown origin. Ridiculopathy is a play on ridiculous. And consortium is consortium. We do have a serious purpose. The Idiopathic Ridiculopathy Consortium is a theater company in Philadelphia who specializes in the works of authors from the loosely defined Theater of the Absurd. And they included Eugene Ionesco, Samuel Beckett, Harold Pinter, and many more. And those works have more than endured the test of time. It's pretty kooky, it's pretty nuts, but it also is very relatable. And nine times out of 10, people will leave IRC shows and say, I don't know what I just saw, but whatever it was, I loved it. Just sit here calmly and listen to the music until you get back some of your composure. We're not worried about leaving people scratching their heads on the way out because it doesn't always make sense. Well, most transcendental tenderness that it calls for, what do they do? What one of our goals is, is to show everybody that absurdism isn't as cerebral as everyone thinks. It's something that every person can really enjoy. Alma, I've got to go to New Orleans right away. Immediately, Alma, by the midnight train. <laughs> um, it's great fun. It's, um, um, <laughs> Surprises unfolding all the time. It's a joy. It's a romp. It's serious and it's a romp. Both. <laughs> like life. Do I always know what it's about? No. The challenge is interpreting some of the playwright's language and making it alive uh, for an audience uh, in our modern world, making them relevant uh, to, a, to an audience here in Philadelphia. Everybody, everything, all the time. <laughs> yeah, absolutely be prepared to be surprised. And we guarantee you, you will take a lot of way and you will be talking about this show for a long time. All we're saying is give absurdism a chance. Yeah.